Oh, hello, sausage. It's Nana Beryl, and today we're playing The Sims 2. Oh, and look, it's Juno Birch and her pussycat Cyril. And Cyril says, enough of the fluffy toy mouse. I want a biscuit. A biscuit and a slice. Where are the custard squares? Give me the sugar, that's right. And look, it's Philly Willy Lopez, who's looking rather dapper in his new violet suit, aren't you, love? Looks like he's having a visitor for dinner. It must be Jesus. Is it Jesus, love? And he says, no, Nana Beryl, stop being silly. If Jesus was coming for dinner, I'd be wearing my gold slippers and my special tie, and I'd be eating peanut butter and marmite. That's right. Oh, and look, he wants a custard square. He says, I don't want this fluffy bloody mouse. I want a custard square. Give me a special slice. Give me something with icing. Oh, and look, we're going inside now. And she's reading the Simville movie reviews for Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice and Alien Romulus, aren't you, love? Yes, you are. But it's fake news because it's not a very good newspaper. So it's really bad movie reviews. Yes, that's right, it's just full of fake news. Oh, and look over here. Philly's going to give him some cat biscuits and Cyril says if they got icing. I don't want them if they don't have icing. I'm going on a hunger strike. I'm going to call the RSPCA, you pillock. Give me some chews or some icing. I want something. I need something with sugar. I need some marzipan. That's what I need. Yes. Oh, and look, they're rather amorous, aren't they, love? Yes. Oh, and now she's giving him a serenade. She's showing him what she's going to do at her next tour. That's right. And he says, well, what about the business before we go back to England? You'll have to call up and go and see how your business is doing. So go call a taxi. Oh, and look at Juno. She's got an expression on her face like she's been drinking bubble tea. Don't you love? Yes, you do. Oh, and look, he's burping the pussycat. Yes, he's burping Cyril. And Cyril says, put me down. I don't need burping. I've just had cat biscuits. You're going to make me sick, you bullock. Oh, that's right. Put me down. I'm going to throw up on your shoes now because you decided not to give me a custard square, you ass. That's right, love. Oh, and look, she's doing a business. Let's give her some privacy. So yes, that's right. I said, oh, look, it's Simon, the Uber driver. I thought it was a taxi, but it's an Uber. Hello, Simon, you're amazing. Yes, you are. And look, it's Licorice Hack, and she's come here to meet Juno, but Juno's heading out. She can tell that because because Philly Willy Lopez is in the taxi. That's right, in the Uber, Uber taxi thingy. That's right. She says, look, I'm in a hurry. I've got to go and check on my business before I head back to England. So Simon's taking her to Simville, aren't you, love? And he, she says, no, not to Simville, to Simville Court. Get it right, Nana Beryl, that's right. I've been drinking wine, haven't I, love? Yes, I must have been, because I'm a bit too lately, aren't I, love? Oh, and look, they've arrived at Juno Way, which is like Subway, but stunning. Oh, and look, it's Ronald Grump. How are you, Ronald Grump? How's Agent Orange in your comb over, darling? How's your ear? I hope you found an earring large enough to fit your ear lobe, love. Yes, I hope so. Oh, look, where are you going? Why are you going outside, love? Why aren't you going inside? Oh, she's going to play on the playground equipment, are we? Oh, my God, slap my bottom and call me Charlie. It's a pink elephant. Haven't seen one of those before, sausage. I don't think I've ever drunk enough to see one of those, love. No, that's right. Oh, and they're being a bit amorous, darling, aren't they? Yes, they are. Make sure you keep this parental guidance recommended, sausage. Don't do anything too amorous. We'd hate you to suck each other's tonsils out in front of the cameras. Oh, and what are they doing now? I think she's going to play a bit of football. Yes. Oh, my God, how butch play football do you shouldn't be playing football in that dress you might split some seams darling yes a look at her nice friday night 1960s get up with her dangly earrings and a gorgeous 60s print look at it isn't it beautiful yes it is and i think we should head inside and see who else is arriving shouldn't we oh look at catch your laters the drag queen yes and she's arriving inside juno way yes which is like subway but stunning Oh, and look at it, love, the Juno menu. Oh, and look at the rubber gloves, that's right. Pause, that's right, pause, love. Oh, and what are you ordering? She's ordering a coffee, I think. And Oh, look, it's a homosexual. Hello, Kenny Buff, the homosexual, that's right, love. You go over there and do homosexual things. Oh, and look, we've got, oh, well, who are these two little handsome men? What are they doing? Oh, oh, look, he's spinning around and showing us his gorgeous T-shirt. Oh, and look, Kenny Buff is doing butch things. Yes, he is. He's scoffing down some protein cakes. Look at him, love. Oh, how masculine. Yes, you're very manly, love. Yes, you are a little manly homosexual. Yes, you are. Oh, and he likes the protein, as you can tell. You can tell by the size of his arms, can't you, love? What are you doing now, love? He says, I'm going over here to show you my behind. Yes, I am. He's going over here to show us his backside. Yes, he is. Oh, love, you've got a bread loaf down there and some cake, haven't you, love? That's right, show us your cake, darling. 
Oh, now what else are we going to have a look at? Oh, and look at Dixie Cartel and Regina Regina. They call her Dixie Cartel because her father's in the Italian Mafia. That's right, love. Hence the surname Cartel. Oh, and she can't get inside, can you? Oh, and look, it's a transphobe. Go away, transphobe. We don't like transphobes here, do we? No, we don't. Oh, but she's not even trans, is she? She's a drag queen, but he thought she was a transsexual. That's right. Oh, and look. A transsexual transvestite from Transylvania. That's right, love. Oh, and look, it's a pussycat. It's a pussycat sculpture. Maybe it's of Cyril the Pussycat. Now, shall we put this wall up? Yes, and look at the clock. Isn't it nice decor, isn't it? And look, we have a nerd. We like our little nerds, don't we? Hello, nerd. How are you? Shall we zoom in? Yes, we'll zoom in and have a look at the nerd. Oh, he's a nice nerd. Look, he's wearing a 1975 Wonder Woman singlet, aren't you, love? Yes, you are. Wearing a little tank top. What are you going to order, love? You're going to order, order something nerdy, like like um, sparkling water, probably, love. Yes, sparkling water. Yes, he wants sparkling water. And oh, look, we have vending machines, aren't they amazing? Yes. And she's just got a Diet Coke, haven't you, love? And she says, no, I've got a regular Coke, and a barrel. Pay attention. What is Regina Regina doing? I think she's using her MP3 player from 2004, aren't you, love? Yes, you are, and she's headbanging to Megan Trainer, aren't you, love? Yes, she's listening to Megan Trainer's mother. Yes, she is. Look, she's headbanging to Megan Trainer. Isn't that different? I've never heard of someone headbanging to Megan Trainer. Oh, it's a very good song, that, isn't it, love? Yes, mother, by Megan Trainer. Very good. Oh, and look, it's oh, and on one side of the screen we had, we have uh, Brianka Del Moro who likes Moro Bath, and she's admiring the Cyril the Cat sculpture. Must have been done by Juno Birch, maybe. And also on the other side of the screen we had Rue Moore. Where is she? She's over here, isn't she? Yes, she is. Let's follow her. Let's have a look, love. What are you doing? She says I'm here on business, Nana Beryl. Yes, she's here on business. She's meant to meet somebody to talk about her new venture. Oh, look, and I think it's James Belsh. Yes, it's James Belsh from the Belsh Twins, yes. He's looking very gorgeous. He must have been slugging this morning. Yes, early hours of the morning. I think he put his Vaseline on, I love. Yes, you've been putting on your Vaseline. Oh, and look, she's looking gorgeous, isn't she? Someone's been using AHAs and retinoids, haven't you, love? Yes, you have. Oh, and what are you doing, Brianka? She says, I'm talking to the Little Mermaid statue from Norway. And I'm going to talk to this one, yes. He's a big boy, isn't he, love? She goes, oh, look at him, he is a big boy, yes. It's like, oh, I think he's anatomically correct. Oh, and oh, and then we've followed her inside, and now she's going outside again. Well, that was a bit of a cut to the future, isn't it, love? It's like back to the future, but without Michael J. Fox, the poor bugger. Oh, and, oh, and look, Willy Willy Lopez is outside, and he needs to go to the bathroom, don't you, love? Yes, you do. Know, you come along over here, love, you come this way. Come on, follow me. I always to go back and collect him. Come on, love, that's right. Try it a second time, shall we? Yes, that's right. Here we go, love. Follow me this way. Going to the bathroom. Maybe we should give him some privacy. Yes, we'll put the walls up. Yes, that's right, love. Behind the sign. Go back a bit further. Go inside. There's a toilet restroom in there. Now look at the front of Juno Way, shall we? Let's have a look at it. Do you like it, love? Do you? Did I do a good job, sausage? I hope I did. It looks quite nice, doesn't it, dear? Yes, Juno Way. Like Subway, but stunning. Oh, and look, what are you looking at, love? Oh, she's having a pervert half-naked man. Oh, yes, that's right, darling. She can't, doesn't know quite what to say to him. Yes, he's a bit attractive, isn't he, love? He's very handsome. And Philly Willy Lopez says hello. He says, hello, half-naked man. He says, hello, Philly Willy Lopez in your violet suit with your special hat. He said, you must be having Jesus over for dinner later. Now, what are you drinking, love? Oh, my God, look at them, love. I do try to keep this PG, but every time I do, they start acting like they want to nibble on each other's naughty bits, don't they, love? Yes, they do. Oh, and now he's talking to Half-Naked Man. He's talking about how he should be in that new Rocky Horror Picture Show play that they've got. He says, all you need is a maybe a dress and maybe a hat. And he says, well, I have a dress at home, but I would be no good in Rocky Horror Picture Show. I wouldn't make a very good transvestite. And besides that, I don't think... I don't I don't think Frankenfurter wore anything like that, did he? Yes, I don't think he did. I don't think he wore a dress. I think he wore underwear, darling, underwear. Yes, maybe a necklace. I think there was a necklace involved. Because I have a necklace at home, but just not the kind that goes with a dress or without a dress. Because I'm not very good like that. I don't have many girly things at home because I'm very butch. Yes, I am. Look at me. Says so a half-naked man. I'm very butch. So look at my biceps. Yes, oh, and look, it's catch, and she's having a good conversation, isn't she, having a bit of a natter at Juno Way, yes, that's right, the place that's like Subway, but stunning, that's right, dear, do we have a look around the sides and back, yes, I think we should, look at the front again, isn't it, gorgeous, yes, it is, it's stunning, 
Oh, isn't it nice? I put some little rose gardens out the front, didn't I? Yes, I did. Oh, well, should we have a look around the other side and look at the menu? Oh, you can't see the menu very well, can you? There is actually a Juno burger on there, but you can't see it. Yes, I won't do all the trouble of creating a menu there, and it isn't showing up much because it's a bit blurry, isn't it? We can't see the details. Oh, you can't see the Juno shake on there too with whipped cream on top, no. Oh, love, what are you doing? Oh, be careful, love. We might have to medicate you and put you in a village if you act like that, love. Stop jumping in the puddles. People will think you need some help. Yes, they will. Oh, and she's still rocking. Yes, she is. What are you doing, Dixie? And she says, what does it look like, Nana Beryl? I'm talking to the magic marmot in the forest who smokes wacky backy and speaks Italian. That's right. So she's having, she's having her Diet Coke. She says, it's not a Diet Coke, it's regular Coca-Cola. Get it right, Nana Beryl. Now these two young men, yes, they're friends and they're talking about university, aren't you, love? Yes, he's talking about how he wants to go to university and study philosophy. And this other young man, his friend, is talking about how he wants to go to the Douglas Educational Academy to the Tom Zavini Special Effects Makeup Program and do makeup effects for movies. Yes, that's right. He said, but it costs a fair bit of money. Yes, it does. He said, but it looks amazing. I'll learn how to use lipstick. Yes. Oh, and where are you going, love? And she's going round the corner, are you? Oh, no, she said she's going outside. Are you going outside? That's right, love. Go on, eat a sandwich. That's right, love. Eat a sandwich. Now, where are you going, Dixie? What are you doing? She says, I'm going outside to sit on the outdoor equipment. Yes, I am. That's not what I asked you, love. What are you doing? She says, well, I'm sitting here contemplating, meditating and eating chocolate. Yes, but I need some Toblerone. Have you got any Toblerone, Nana Beryl? No, I don't have any, love. Well, that's not good enough. I need some Toblerone. I need some meditation music. Yes, I do. Oh, and look, it must be animatronic. Look, an animatronic elephant. Oh, my God, love. Isn't that a big word, darling? Animatronic. Yes, shall we say it again? I think we should. I think we should say it three times for good measure animatronic there we go love i just said it isn't that amazing oh that's right love what are you doing are you going to rub his belly yes she's going to rub the belly of the animatronic elephant aren't you dear yes you are look at her rub his belly of the animatronic elephant shall we say it another time yes animatronic there we go darling oh and look at the vending machines aren't they amazing at juno way yes they are and look they've got salt and pepper shakers there too dear oh now what are you doing, Dixie Cartel? Are you waiting for to be placed in a seat somewhere? Yes, I think she's wanting to find out where she can sit so she can have some dinner. Yes, I look at the alien egg glove. Yes, I think you should come and view the alien egg catcher. Maybe it's a planet. I don't know if it is an alien egg. So I think it's an alien sculpture. Yes, maybe of a planet. Oh, and what are you doing, Brianca Del Moro? Mm. Who likes Moro bars? I think you should come over here and listen to the animatronic elephant. That's right. Oh, listen to it. Isn't that amazing? It's very loud, isn't it, dear? It might rattle your speakers on your laptop or on your phone, darling. Yes, it might. Look at the picture of Juno way in the background. Oh, yes, and she's admiring the animatronic elephant. Oh, now, where is Rue Mole? We saw her before, didn't we? Yes, I think she's in here somewhere, are you, Rue? Rue Mull, where are you, darling? She was having a business meeting over her new television programme, yes. Oh, there she is. Shall we zoom in? I think we should. Yes, she was meant to be meeting her business partner, and she says, well, my business partner's late. We were discussing a new TV programme. Yes, we're going to use a, have a new TV series. It was going to be called Drag Space. That's right. Not Drag Race, Drag Space, which is like Big Brother, but with drag queens. That's right, love. Yes, so she was contemplating that. They're having discussions with the television network, but they haven't arrived yet. They're a bit late, aren't they, darling? Yes, hopefully they don't stand you up. Maybe they were busy. Maybe they're busy doing something else, love. Oh, and look, oh, look at it. Oh, look, it must have hydraulics. Look at it, love. It prants up in the air. Yes, it's a very amazing pink animatronic elephant, isn't it, love? Oh, yes, she can't believe how amazing it is. Oh, and look at Catcher. She looks like a wombat, doesn't she, love? Yes, she's looking like a wombat that's had too much food colouring in its fizzy drink, don't you, love? Yes, you do. And what are you doing? She says, I'm going to put my panty shields in the trash compactor. Yes, I am. Where's the waste bin here? Have you got a waste bin like at Subway, she says. 
Yes, but she doesn't really use pentagons, does she, love? Because you're a drag queen, darling, yes. But she's just trying to be funny, aren't you, love? And now she's looking at the special planet. It's a special sculpture that must be done by Juno Birch because it's stunning. That's right, love. Yes, it's very stunning, isn't it? Oh, now what is he doing? He's wearing his... Oh, look, he's wearing a top, but we can't see what it says. He's got some words on the front of it, which I can't read because I'm a bit old and I'm a bit blind, love. I'm getting a little bit visually impaired in my old age, darling, I think. I'm not seeing things as strongly as I used to, dear. It's part of old age sometimes for some of us. <laughs> oh, be careful, love. Don't go looking too close. You might see his wobbly bits. And that, though in his case, it won't be wobbly, will they? Because they're made of cement. Yes, darling, we don't like cement wobbly bits. Do we, dear? No, we don't. I think we should look inside. Oh, and look at these vending machines by Exum and Numenor from Mod The Sims. They're very good, aren't they, love? Yes. So if you look up the screen name Exum and Numenor on Mod The Sims, you can download these amazing little machines. Well done, love. You've done a very good job at making those. Yes, you have, love. They're gorgeous. Yes, they are. Oh, and look, it's a man in a kilt. Be careful, love. We don't want you staining the linoleum, dear. I hope you've got some underpants on. Make sure you don't have a leaky bladder, dear. Oh, and where are you going, sausage? I think she's going to the ladies' room, aren't you, love? Yes, you are. I think you're going to have a bit of a puddle. Yes, she's going to have a tinkle in the toilet. Oh, and look, you could wash your hands over here and use the flowing soap. And oh, and look, it's a hand towel. Isn't that good? I got those from Mod The Sims too, darling. I think I did anyway. I can't remember because I'm old. That's right, love. And look at the mirror. Yes. Oh, well, now we have these little cracker barrels. Look, is this Miss Medical Adventure? I think it is, love. Oh, I think that's her. There she is. Look at her. She's an amazing-looking trans woman. Yes, she is. Isn't she amazing? Look at her. She's gorgeous. Don't you like her glasses and her hair? Yes. Oh, my God, you're stunning. I do like your eyeliner. She must be using the cold pencil. Oh, and look at these little cracker barrels. Oh, look at them all dancing around. I think they must have fungal infections. Look at them, darling. They've got, they've got ants in their pants, yes. Oh, my God, another one must have a fungal infection. It must be contagious. Oh, they've all got fungal infections, love, yes, including catcher. That's not good enough, love. Oh, I didn't know drag queens could get fungal infections, love. Oh, maybe it's jock itch. Oh, and look, now she's talking about American politics and how she's going to contact Elon Musk to see if she can go and live on another planet, depending on who wins the elections. That's right. Yes, she might have to build a bunker, eh? Oh, and look, it's Kenny Buff. Yes, and he's leaving, are you? He says, no, Nana Beryl, I'm just going to the corner store to get a to get a bag of crisps. That's right, love. So he's disappeared. He'll be back soon. Yes, well, he'll be back soon. Kenny Buff, the homosexual. That's right, love. Oh, and shall we have another look at this? Oh, and look, it's Juno Bird. She's come inside. She wants to have some dinner, don't you, love? She says, yes, I want some salad. Give me the salad. I want a vinaigrette. Yes, she does. And where's, where's Philly Willie Lopez gone? I think he's over here somewhere. Oh, there he is. Look at him. He's still looking dapper in his suit. He's kept very cool, isn't he? Yes, he's got that special masculine allure in the suit today, hasn't he? Yes, he's been swirling around to show us his amazing new suit. Must be tailor-made by, by Versace. Oh, look at him, he's swirled around again just to show us the side pockets. Now maybe we should jump over here and look at the decor, love. Oh, look at it. Pause, that's right, love. Pause, the iconic yellow glove, that's right, love, with the nail polish or the paint. Oh, now what are you ordering, love? I think he's going to order a hamburger, darling, yes. But that's not what Juno wants, is it, love? No, she wants a salad, don't you, love? Yes, you want a salad to keep your figure. Yes, you do. She wants to keep her figure. So she's going to have a salad with a rosemary vinaigrette, uh, dear. Yes, you are. Oh, it's a shame you're not sitting together, dear. Yes, but as they say, absence makes the heart grow fonder. Oh, yes, sometimes it does and sometimes it doesn't, love. Depends on the people. Oh, and what are you eating, love? He is eating a hamburger. Is it very nice, love? He says, yes, it is very nice. It's got ketchup on it and mayonnaise and a bit of aioli. He's eating an egg burger. Yes, not a hamburger, an egg burger that has a potato fritter in the middle. And what does Juno order besides a salad? Oh, it doesn't look like a salad, love. That looks like Spongebob Squarepants Pie, doesn't it, love? Yes, it does. That was a bit of a tongue twister, wasn't it, love? Let's see if I can say that again. Spongebob Squarepants Pie. Oh, my God. Very good, aren't I, love? Yes, I am. I must be must be drinking lots of energy drinks. Must be giving me wings. Yes, that's right. Oh, look. Kenny Buff is leaving, I think. Yes, he is. He's leaving. Goodbye, Kenny Buff. Thank you for showing us your homosexuality. That's 
That's right, love. You're amazing. Yes, you are. We like our little homosexuals. And what do we have here? We have unsavoury charlatan. He's a very well-dressed little pickpocket, aren't you, love? Yes, we don't like you very much, so you should bugger off and leave us alone. You're not taking someone's wallet tonight. You're not, love. No, we're having too much of a good time at Juno Way, which is like Subway, but stunning. That's right, love. So bugger off. That's right. Go away. They love us, they go away, you're going in the wrong direction, over to the left hand side, darling. Oh, and look, it's the jukebox, I think we should turn on the jukebox, shouldn't we, and make some music. Oh, and look, she's just had enough of the elephant, yes she has, she's had enough of the pink elephant. Yes, the animatronics are a bit boring now, she's had quite enough of that. Oh my God, love it, look, he's dancing, look at him. Someone's been taking dancing lessons from Kermit the Frog and Mr Bean, haven't you, love? This is what happens when you put toilet seat on a public toilet to stop you getting germs, love, and it gets stuck up your butthole. Yes, and then you can't get it out when it gets stuck up your butt, stuck up your ass. Oh, look, yes, it's got too much perfume in that toilet paper by the looks of it, love. Look at him jiggling around. It's not moving, darling. Now, I think what you need is, is some barbecue tongs to pull it out, dear, because the dancing isn't going to quite work, I don't think, sausage. Oh, yes, no. Oh, that's right, love, his bottom's hurting. Oh, and look, I think unsavoury charlatan, you need to go home, or we're going to call the police, love, yes. We're going to call the police and they'll bring down their disco mobile with the flashing lights, love, yes, they will, and they'll arrest you and put you in cuffs. You might like that, you saucy little minx, won't you? Yes, you will, to bugger off, leave us alone, that's right. Oh, and look, it's DK Bowling, the author of Harry Stotter and the Order of the Eunuchs, that's right, darling. Oh, yes, what are you doing? Are you going to dance too, like these little cracker barrels? Oh, I wonder what they've got on the jukebox music. Oh, they're going for it, aren't they, love? They've been taking lessons. I think they have. What is she eating? I don't know what she's going to order. I think she's going to order an autumn salad. And this one here's laughing because she knows that DK Bowling doesn't realise that Miss Fluffy Boom Boom's over here is actually a trans woman. Yes, that's right. Yes, because I don't think DK Bowling likes trans woman very much, I don't think. But I could be wrong, who knows? Oh, and what are you doing, James? He's talking about Sydney Opera House. Have you been to Australia? I think you've been to Australia. Yes, you have. Oh, and look at them all move, love. Yes, that's what you get for using two-ply toilet paper. It gets stuck up your butthole and you can't get it out, love. Yes, we need special barbecue tongs for the whole lot of them by the looks, love. Oh, and look, it's DK Bowling. I think she's going to dance as well, but I don't like your fashion dress, love. I don't like the skirt in the top there. There's a cure for that kind of fashion, love. It's called a box of matches. That's right, dear. Oh, and look, it's Juno Birch. Hello, Juno Birch and your Friday night get-up. Oh, my God, she's drinking coffee. Yes, yes, to have something to keep her awake, love. She's busy. She's assessing her own business. Oh, and look... It's Philly Willie Lopez, and they're going to have a bit of a romantic dance, aren't they, love? Well, maybe not romantic, maybe they're just going to do a bit of an Irish jig. Oh, they've been taking rock and roll lessons, haven't they, how? 1964. Oh, and is that Madonna, I think it is? Oh, and look at her, love. Looks like she's been using the same toilet paper. Oh, no, she was just imitating them, she was taking the mickey. She's busy, she wants to sit down, she's having a business meeting. Yes, she is. Who's the business meeting with, love? Who is it? Oh, I don't know who that is, love. It looks like Mr. Hamilton, the one oh, who's not having, having a, big a good discussion, isn't she, love? Yes, she is. And oh my God, look at Sherilyn Yarns. It's the iconic Australian legend, Sherilyn Yarns. Not to be confused with Sherilyn Barnes, love. No, not Sherilyn Barnes, love. Oh, look, and they're all doing this muscle. What have you been doing, Sherilyn? And she says, well, I've been knitting knickers for my pet squirrel. That's right, love, but now I'm dancing. Yes, I'm dancing like there's no tomorrow, because maybe there might not be. You just never know, do you, love? No, you don't. Oh, look at her. She's looking gorgeous. She hasn't got her glasses on. What are you doing, love? Are you wearing contacts? I think she's wearing contacts, I suggest. Oh, and Philly Willie Lopez has had enough. He doesn't want to stretch his wonderful new violet designer suit. Do you, love? No, you don't. Because he might have Jesus coming for dinner. Yes, that's right. You never know. He might be having a bit of a soiree tonight. You never know, darling. And what's this man got white on his face for? Is he being racist? I think he is. How dare you be racist in a Juno video, love? It's not allowed. This video has to be stunning. 
some are very synchronised, aren't they? Yes, they are. Oh, my God, they've been getting lessons from someone. I think it must be the people who trained um, Kylie Minogue for Padam Padam. I think it is. Um, look at them. They're all synchronised. It's like perfect timing. Anyone would think this was a video game, so I said, yes. Oh, now what are you doing, love? What are you doing? Oh, he's going to sit on the other side of the seat now, Philly Willie Lopez. He wants Juno to hurry up. He says, look, hurry up, love. We've got things to do and people to see. Oh, and look at her dance, love. Juno, look at her go. Yes. Oh, my God, she nearly fell over, didn't you, love? Oh, and look at Philly Willie Lopez. Oh, he's a bit socially educated, isn't he, love? So he's going to go and have a talk to someone. Oh, and look at them, love. They're lacking a bit of energy. I think they've had a bit too much sugar. Yes, this is the part where they come down from their sugar addiction. And he's going to be socially responsible and go and talk to the people of the business that he owns. Yes, with, with uh, Juno. That's right, love. So he's talking to Cheryl and Yarns. He says, hello, Cheryl and Yarns. What have you been doing? And she says, well, before I came here, I was sticking the remote control up my butt and playing backgammon. But now I'm going to eat some cake. Enough of the rabbit fodder. I want some icing and some sugar. Yes, that's right. And I want a bit of cream too, but this hasn't got any on it, so I'm not very happy. I want cream. Do you realise it's vegetarian if it's vegetarian cake? Yes, it is. Oh, and she goes, oh, I don't like that then. Yes, she's going to regurgitate some of it, I think, because she doesn't like plant-based food, do you, love? No. Oh, very unhealthy, darling. Oh, and what are you doing, Miss Dixie Cartel? And she says, well, Nana Beryl, I'm going to talk to the meerkats at London Zoo about climate change. So that's what she's doing over the phone, love. She's talking to the meerkats at London Zoo. Yes, she's got them on loudspeaker. Yes, it's very late, love. She goes, yes, well, there is a time difference. Yes, there's a bit of a time difference from where we are in Simville. Oh, and look, it's Regina, Regina. What are you doing, love? And she says, well, I'm going home to have a soiree with canapes where I'm going to swish around in my dress and show people things. That's right, love. Oh, and look, it's, it's Del Moro. Yes, that's right. It's Brianka Del Moro. She's going home too, I think, aren't you, love? She goes, yes, I need to feed the special, the special squirrels that live under my bed. Yes, they only eat Marmite and chocolate biscuits. So she's got to go too, otherwise she'll be late. Yes, and they won't be very happy and they might chew right through the mattress springs. Oh, and what else do we have here? Who else is going home, love? Where's Juno gone? Is she still there? I think her and Philly are still there. Oh, and look, Philly Lopez is hoovering her tonsils. Yes, she's checking she's still got them or whether she's had them out or not. That's right, love. Oh, and look, she's having a swing. Be careful, love. We don't want to see your panties. The dress is more than enough sausage. Yes, it is. Oh, yes, that's right, dear. What do you want, Philly? Are you a bit whiffy? He wants some links underarm deodorant. Yes, he does. And now they're going to take some special detergent they put in the washing machine, but they're going to stick it in here, love. Yes, they're going to do naughty things. Look at them. Yes, they want to see it froth up. Look at the way that English cover their mouths when they say, oh, naughty. Look at them. Yes, oh, how naughty. They have a bit of a giggle. Yes, and move to the side to watch it foam up. But it's not working, love, because it's a low foam sud one. Yes, it has hardly any sodium lauryl sulfate in it. That's right, dear. Oh, and what are we doing over here, love? Are we going to sit down and have a bit of a talk? Yes, they are. Having a discussion about world peace. Yes, they are. And all about money. Yes, all about money in the monetary system. They're talking about investing on the share market. Yes, that's right. They're talking about running the business as well and how when they go back to England, they'll have to try and organise someone to manage this place. Yes, so he's having a drink, aren't you, love? He's having a Fanta. Look, it's a Fanta. Must have got it from the vending machine. Oh, and look who's this, dear. Oh, it's Juno, yes. Are you going are you going home, love? And she goes, no, I'm going inside, Nana Beryl, so I can use the other door just to check that, that they work before I leave. Oh, and now she's going to ring up somebody. Yes, she's ringing up an Uber. Yes, she is. She's ringing up Uber driver called Natalie. Isn't that right, love? Yes, she's ringing up Natalie. And Natalie said she'll be here soon. One more look at Juno Ways. Yes, Juno Way, like Subway, but stunning. Oh, and here's Natalie. Hello, Natalie. How are you doing? Oh, love your ponytail, Natalie. It's very nice. I think she's got a special butterfly clip that she should be putting in it, though, hasn't she? Oh, and they're on their way home. Yes, they are. Thanks, Natalie. Yes. Don't forget to leave Natalie a tip sausage. That's right. Oh, and I think that's where we'll leave it for today, dear. So thank you so much for tuning in, and tune in again next time for my next special video. Oh, thanks, sausage. If you like this, like and subscribe. Thanks, darling. Bye-bye.